Good evening everyone and welcome to the bedroom, mm. to the boudoir. <laughs> if you watched my latest video, you would have known that my little assistant, my little shadow, my little kitten, Yumi, um, has had surgery yesterday. She has been neutered so she is now in recovery and she is recovering in the bedroom that's why we are in the bedroom today it is to keep an eye on her and see if she's all right here is my little baby girl she decided that my partner's pajama pants was where she would be comfy to stay on tonight. Are you okay, my baby? Oh, look at the cute little onesie. <laughs> she looks like a poodle. She's all fluffy on the head and all teeny tiny on the body. <laughs> While Yumi is rested, I am not going to be doing much. I'm not going to be going out because I will be keeping an eye on her. What else is there to do than work during the day and crochet in the evening? <laughs> so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to make the six star crochet blanket. I hate TikTok. I can't stand the thing. I only go on my, so on my days that I go into the office, that is the only days that I watch TikTok when I'm on my lunch break because I don't really have anything else to do on my lunch break really so I just watch TikTok uh, even and yeah and uh, at the moment it is filled with um, all the crochet that are making that six days style blanket and I thought that was really cool and um, I like a challenge so I thought yeah, I'm gonna try the six day style blanket. <laughs> Downstairs we have uh, an area that is uh, the music chilling area that is set up with um, my partner's record player and all his records and we have a couple of chairs and a sofa on there. And my plan is to make that blanket for the sofa and I want it to match uh, the, the rug that we have uh, on the floor which is like blues and uh, a couple of blues and white uh, so I'm going to mix that and try to make the blanket matching as much as possible uh, and of course I will be using the yarn that I have in my stash and the good thing is I have a lot of blues for some reason <laughs> so I should be alright <laughs> I am pretty sure I will be needing a lot more yarn than this but this is what I picked up so far so I've got some different blues and my whites but yeah this is my color scheme so far which whoop, <laughs> dropped everything which will um, change I'm pretty sure during these six days um, because it's quite a big blanket <laughs> uh, but so far this is what I have all these um, so I'm going to have dinner quickly because I finished uh, the day job and I am a bit hungry so I'm going to eat and then um, I am going to start the six day star blanket by Betty Magnet. I am back. Dinner has been eaten uh, while watching House of Gucci. I have started. Uh, and now I am going to make a start on my blanket and I will update you on the progress later. <laughs> Welcome to day two of the crochet six day style blanket 
and without further ado here is my update on day one I am very happy I have done it last night while watching House of Gucci I finished it it's a very random film it was all over the place and the accents were like too forced so it was all right but this it's better. Look at that. I love the colour scheme. It is so cool. <laughs> um, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do tonight because we have a little um, date night plan. So we are going to make a pizza and watch a film. So I will see and maybe do a puzzle. So I will see how I go if I manage to make anything and I will update you but so far day one is really good I'm really happy <laughs> hey good evening and welcome to day three <laughs> pizza was mwah, amazing and something else that is amazing do you want to know my day two update. Look how cool. It is now a cat sized blanket. And it's really nice. I still love the color scheme. And as I expected, I have already run out of one of the blues. So I'm going to add another blue, another color to it. But I'm really happy. It looks really cool and really fun. Welcome to day four <laughs> and without further ado once again here is my day three update it is getting a lot bigger so it is taking a lot longer to do one row but it's looking really cool I have also added that new color which looks really nice this young lady is doing really well as well we are not in the bedroom anymore because she doesn't want to be stuck in a room anymore but still in a onesie this is where her stitches are she's still in a onesie she's still wearing it very well yeah she's eating she's doing really good i'm really proud of her <laughs> so we are good just a few more days in that onesie and she'll be okay It is 10.30 p.m. on day five and this is my day five update and I have decided to stop here. <laughs> I am shattered. It is taking forever to finish one row and because it's going on a sofa and not on a bed or anything I have decided that it will be perfect to stop here because it is a great size now and I'm really happy about it so I'm just going to step up and show you the full size but yeah I am stopping on day five here it is I don't know how to uh, show it without him being like all weird, weirdly shaped. <laughs> the fact that it has seven corners is a bit difficult, but it is a seven corner stars and it is looking really cool. And I can't wait to put it on my sofa. <laughs> Usually when a 
project uh, takes a long time, when it's a really big project, I end up um, giving up. Uh, that's why I just don't do them. I have tried the hexagon cardigan so many times and I just ended up giving up because it just takes too long. Um, and it's very repetitive, so I get bored very easily. And I think also because um, my tension is really tight. Uh, I started crochet by doing a migurumi and you have to have a tight tension for toys, so soft toys. So uh, I struggle to have a looser um, tension. So yeah, so for me it just takes forever. <laughs> but I am so proud of myself for finishing this blanket. I did not give up on it. Just to clarify, I did not give up on it. I just decided to stop there because it was the right size for my sofa. I did not give up, <laughs> just in case you're wondering. I am very proud of myself. I am probably not going to make another blanket in one go like that, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I am very proud of myself. I am just knackered now though. <laughs> just want to go to sleep <laughs> uh so yeah uh thank you betty magnet for this awesome uh little challenge and pattern i i really enjoyed it i'm really happy with it my partner is really happy with it and my sofa is going to look cool <laughs> if you liked my video please leave a thumb up maybe a comment and a little subscribe that would make me happy <laughs> if you like seeing my video or seeing me in all my different pajamas <laughs> because i crochet in the evening mainly like after the day job uh or on weekends so you will see me get dressed on weekends but in the evening i just get comfy and it's in my PJs <laughs> so if you like to see me crochet my PJs just give it a, a little subscribe <laughs> and I will see you on my next video bye everyone <laughs>